If you're driving in the Deventa area of Bosnia and Herzegovina, you might be planning on travelling south towards Sarajevo. If so, the main route will take you past the city of Doboj, but before arriving at Doboj, in fact some 20 kilometres before, you'll arrive at the royal village Kotromenicevo, the ethno-settlement there. Many local enthusiasts, together with local authorities and government, contribute to the development of rural ethno-tourism in the country. The aim of ethnotourism in Bosnia and Herzegovina is to preserve the tradition and natural beauty of the local environment and to show tourists and visitors how people used to live in times long ago. If you follow our channel you'll know we've visited our local ethno village many times and the link to that is in the description. These interesting ethno villages are scattered around the country in rural areas such as on the slopes of beautiful mountains, in the lowlands and fields where people still live in a very traditional way. While travelling with our car from Control Rental Car of Banja Luka we stopped off at Kotra Manicevo. The Kotra Manicevo ethno village is named after the Kotra Manic family, a Serbian ruling dynasty back in the days of medieval Bosnia. The ethno village is built on the bank of the river Velichanka. The village is located in preserved nature and its ancient ambience and the authentic architecture of those Bosnian kings is an ideal choice to visit and relax for the whole family. The village includes a market of local handicrafts and eco products, a children's playground, water mills, a small lake and a rest area for camping and much much more. In the restaurant in the central part of the village there are authentic specialities prepared from food produced in the local area according to traditional medieval recipes such as trout with cooked vegetables, veal under the satch, sitzvara, donuts with doughboy smoked cheese and many more. For anyone planning to stay overnight visitors have a wide choice of activities on offer. A walk through the untouched nature of the hilly landscapes of Vučak, sightseeing at the medieval fortresses in Doboj, Modrica or Maglai or maybe fishing on the Bosna Velichanka or Ukrina rivers. There's also paragliding on the Osran mountain. We found the ambience amazing and the service and presentation by the staff extremely professional. We were amazed by the local version of Shopska salad that was served with, can you believe it, local smoked cheese. So this video is one of our top tips that you might consider when visiting Bosnia and Herzegovina. And once again thanks to Control Rent-A-Car of Banja Luka for supporting our video.